Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 3.28 p.m. And it's Saturday, October 14th, 2023. Anyway, as you know, a couple of reviews ago, I reviewed a um, some Black Rifle Coffee Company drinks that I found at Dollar Tree. I thought they were, like, discontinuing those drinks, because that's why they had them at Dollar Tree, or they may have been, like, overstocked or something. But, um, I guess, um, I went to my local, um, Midway gas station, and I got the Black Rifle Coffee Company drinks in there. I guess their, like, distributor was just delivering them that day, because he was, like, putting them in the refrigerator. The guy, like, works for the company. And, um, I seen some, like, um, two different drinks that I haven't had before from Black Rifle Coffee Company. And they didn't have these drinks at Dollar Tree, so I guess these ones might be brand new. Well, one of them was the Vanilla Bomb one, but it's just in a new can design. But it's now in a, um, Dallas Cowboys, like, design can. But now it just says Vanilla instead of Vanilla Bomb. But they have this flavor, this, like, a brand new flavor for me anyway. Um, but yeah, they didn't have this at Dollar Tree. Or the um, vanilla, like um, Dallas Cowboys cans. So I think those ones might be new cans. Um, but it's weird that they had them at Dollar Tree too. And now they're brand new at the gas station. They're more expensive at the gas station, you know. Um, so try to get them at Dollar Tree while you can, I guess. Because um, they're cheaper, I guess. Instead of getting them at the gas station. But it's interesting um, that they have them at Dollar Tree right now. But they also just got them in at the gas station, though. For full price, you know. But um, anyway, this one sounds like it might be pretty good. We shall see. This is like one of the smaller can ones. This is like one of the espresso ones. Um, but anyway, this one's like a flavored espresso. The ones I reviewed before were like just the normal espresso with cream and the um, mocha one. Um, this one sounds like, yeah, it might be pretty good. We shall see. Anyway, so yeah, today I'm going to be reviewing the um, Salted Caramel Espresso Black Rifle Coffee Company, like coffee drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. It's like a light brown camouflage design. Looks pretty cool. Like the orange too, because orange is like one of my favorite colors. So it's a pretty interesting color combination. I actually think when I was little, I think I had like a um, pair of like jeans that were like light brown with orange. Um, so it reminded me of that. See what I mean? I'm going to silver top with the silver tab. Bombs of Best Buy Dean production code. Best Buy June 29th, 2024. So it's still fresh for a while. It's an all labeled design. Around the top it says good source of protein, 100% Arabica coffee. And it says the same thing around it again. Veteran founded Black Rifle Coffee Company, BRCC. Espresso salted caramel, naturally and artificially flavored. America's coffee and has American flag gluten-free 200 milligrams caffeine. So, oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Definitely you lit, you know, drink in moderation. You probably shouldn't um, drink it if you have any anxiety problems and stuff. So, yeah, it'll definitely get you pretty lit. It's pretty strong. 11 fluid ounces, 325 milliliters. Has the Black Rifle Coffee Company logo, like, all the way in the background and stuff, too. It's, like, in different, like, parts of it, like, towards the bottom and the middle and stuff. Um, but yeah, the military veterans at Black Rifle Coffee Company had developed this kick-ass espresso salted caramel that is a blend of espresso, milk, protein, and caffeine to help dominate your day. Serving suggestions, shake well, best served shoulder over ice. Has a BRCC QR code, projects their website, scan me, and it shows a phone. Refrigerate after opening, produced in the United States for domestic import ingredients. Enjoyed by date on can, please recycle, has some recycling stuff, probably distributed by Black Rifle Coffee Company. 1144 South 500 West Salt Lake City, Utah, 84101. Caffeine from all sources, 200 milligrams per serving. Caffeine values may vary based on coffee sources. I recommend for children, people since caffeine, pregnant women, or women who are nursing. Contains bioengineered food ingredients. Has the SKU. Gluten-free, the U in the circle and the D. Um, www.blackriflecoffee.com. Contains milk. Nutrition facts, one serving per container. Serving size 11 fluid ounces, 325 milliliters. Amount per serving calories, 170. Total fat 2 grams, 3%. Saturated fat 1.5 grams, 8%. Trans fat 0 grams. Cholesterol 10 milligrams, 3%. Sodium 310 milligrams, 14%. Carbohydrates 30 grams, 11%. Dietary fiber 1 gram, 4%. Total sugars 23 grams, includes up 14 grams added sugars, 28%. Protein 7 grams, 14%. Total 
vitamin D zero micrograms, zero percent, iron zero milligrams, zero percent, vitamin A one hundred thirty micrograms, fifteen percent, vitamin E two milligrams, fifteen percent, calcium two hundred forty seven milligrams, twenty percent, potassium four hundred seventy two milligrams, ten percent, vitamin C twenty nine milligrams, thirty percent. And then it has the other ingredients, or like a coffee, filtered water and coffee, low-fat milk, non-fat ultra-filtered milk, sugar maltodextrin, natural and artificial flavor, sugar root fiber, cellulose gel, cocoa processed with alkali, salt, cellulose gum, natural caffeine carrageenan, vitamin C, vitamin E acetate, vitamin A palmitite, contains milk. So yeah, that's pretty much the entire can, so I'll let you see it real quick. I already showed you the top and the bottom. Espresso salted caramel. But yeah, this was um, $2.89 at my Midway gas station. And the bigger cans they had there were um, three twenty-nine. dollars It's a little bit expensive, especially, you know, since you can get them, some of them right now at Dollar Tree for $1.25. They had the berry mocha one, which I just reviewed, and the um, vanilla balm one, and the, um, yeah, the caramel one that I reviewed before, and the um, mocha one. But on um, the mocha one and the caramel one and the vanilla balm and the berry mocha one, you can still find a Dollar Tree right now. So try to get them there, you know, instead of at the gas station. Because, you know, it's more expensive, you know. So it's better if you get at a Dollar Tree. Other ingredients. That's pretty much the entire can anyway. I'm gonna show off the can up closer quick, so hold on a minute. The Salted Caramel Espresso Black Rifle Coffee Company coffee drink. Cool camouflage can, like a light brown. But yeah, I like the brown and the orange, because orange is like one of my favorite colors, so. Color combination's an interesting color combination. This is by June 29th, 2024, so it's still fresh for a while. 100% Arabica coffee. Good source of protein. Veteran founded. Espresso salted caramel, 200 milligrams caffeine. Secure code projects to their website. SKU, it's a labeled can, smooth texture, nutrition facts, other ingredients, okay, that's pretty much the entire can, anyway now I'm going to finish my review for it, so hold on a minute. Okay, I shut off the can up close, now I'm going to shake it up a little bit. Open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. You probably shouldn't shake it up too much, you know, because, uh, yeah, it's a coffee drink. It might explode, you know, when you open it. Okay, didn't really explode. Um, it doesn't fill the can all the way because it's 11 fluid ounces instead of 12 fluid ounces. So it's, like, um, right out by where the tab, like, ends. But yeah, the color is just, like, a normal, like, coffee drink color. It's, like, a dark brownish color. Try to pour a little bit of it out. A little bit of froth the inside of it where I shook it up a little bit. But yeah, it just looks like a normal coffee drink. But yeah, anyway, the scent, the smell. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, 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 oh yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Really strong coffee scent. Um, yeah, definitely smells like espresso. Um, like the, um, Starbucks, like, espresso drinks and stuff. Um, it smells similar to those. Very strong coffee scent. A little bit like black coffee, but, um, yeah, you do get that sweet caramel scent, though, too, though. Um, yeah, this, um, caramel mixes pretty well with the coffee scent. Makes it a little bit sweeter, but, um, yeah, the coffee definitely stands out more than the caramel. Definitely a really strong, like, espresso coffee drink smell. 
Um, yeah, that's probably a good breakfast drink, you know, probably go good with, like, donuts, pancakes, waffles, French toast. Um, yeah, that's probably a good breakfast drink, a good way to start your day, because, yeah, it's 200 milligrams of caffeine in it, definitely get you lit, you know. Doesn't have any of the B vitamins, though, but, um, like, uh, other energy drinks do, but, um, so it'll get you pretty lit, though. Um, but, yeah, it smells really good, though. Um, I think I had, like, um, some other caramel, like, coffee drinks, where the caramel was actually set out more than the coffee, but, um, yeah, that's when the coffee stands out way more than the caramel. Um, but yeah, still smells pretty good, though, but, um, anyway, now I'm gonna try it, so here goes. Oh, yeah, boys, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Really tasty and very flavorful. smooth, you can probably chug it if you want to, I already want to drink like half the can, it's a little bit watered down, definitely not as thick as like the um, Starbucks drinks, those ones are, like the, you know, Starbucks double shots and stuff, those ones have more of like a thicker, creamier texture, um, but yeah, that's a little bit more watered down, but um, still it has a very strong, pungent coffee flavor, maybe a little bit bitter, it's definitely more of like a darker type of coffee, because yeah, it's espresso, so it has a little bit more of a stronger, like, sort of coffee flavor. Um, but yeah, the salted caramel part of it, um, doesn't really taste like salted caramel to me. It's definitely more like regular caramel, I guess. Definitely, um, sweeter, you know, than salty. Might have a little bit of a salty taste, but, um, yeah, it's definitely more sweet than salty. But yeah, it tastes like a lot of other, like, um, caramel coffee drinks that I've had before, though. Like the, um... Salted Caramel Java Monster, or like, um, yeah, like the caramel-like Starbucks ones. Those ones actually have more caramel taste than the coffee, but, um, yeah, this one, the, um, coffee is definitely more stronger than the, um, caramel, but, um, it's still a really good mix of flavors. <clears throat> Sweet and strong at the same time. It has an, um, okay price, like $2.89 at my local gas station. Um, some Dollar Trees might have this, I'm not really for sure, though, but if, um, your Dollar Tree does have it, definitely get it there, because, you know, it's cheaper. But he has a cool can design, like the colors on and stuff, like the orange and the brown color combination. Um, energy wise, I'll definitely give you this 200 milligrams of caffeine, doesn't have any B vitamins or anything. So I'll still say energy wise. Last maybe about four hours, about five and a half hours of energy at the most. So, oh yeah, boys, I'll definitely give you lit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Energy wise, it works good, it's okay price, it has a cool can design, tastes good. Maybe wish the um, caramel part was a little bit stronger. Um, I um, definitely think, um, the coffee part of it should be, um, a little bit less noticeable, but, um, yeah, I think the caramel should be, um, a little bit stronger, because, um, yeah, the coffee part of it's a little bit strong, but, um, still pretty good, though. It's not too strong, though. Definitely, um, sweeter than regular black coffee, see what I mean? But, um, yeah, I definitely wish the caramel was a little bit more noticeable, because, um, definitely it'd probably be better than, it'd definitely probably be sweeter, but, um, so pretty good though, but um, yeah, definitely try if you can find it. I definitely highly recommend it. Um, it's a pretty good salted caramel coffee drink, but it's not my favorite caramel drink, coffee drink, you know. Definitely like the um, salted caramel job monster over this. That one actually had a more of a salted caramel taste, especially at the bottom of the can. Um, definitely really salty, you know, but um, this though is still pretty good though, definitely sweet. Um, but yeah, definitely try if you can find it really good. I'd probably give the, um, Espresso Salted Caramel Black Rifle Coffee Company drink a 9 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah. Has a cool can design. Energy wise, it works pretty good. It tastes good. Um, could be a little bit cheaper, but, um, some Dollar Trees might have it. Uh, so definitely check your Dollar Tree while you can. Um, while I still got these, you know. But, um, but yeah, if you get it at the gas station, though, it might be a little bit more expensive. But, um. So definitely think you should try it. It's a pretty good, pretty good um, caramel coffee drink. So yeah, pretty sweet. Um, but yeah, it could be a little bit sweeter though. See what I mean? I forgot. I also was going to show off the um, new design. Um, Dallas Cowboys um, Black Rifle Coffee Company drink right quick. And then after that, I'm going to show off the um, new 2023 new design. Um, which is Brew Line New Energy Drink Can. Because I finally bought it. Even though I could find it for a while. Because it's pretty common. See what I mean? The new limited edition Dallas Cowboys designed vanilla Black Rifle Coffee Company drink. This one tastes the same as the vanilla bomb one, but this one's not vanilla bomb, it's just vanilla. But it's basically the same drink, it's just a, you know, new label. Got some coffee on it, I don't to wipe it off. 
Um, I thought it was clean before I made this video, but oh well. I'll have to wipe it off before I take my photo of it. But yeah, triple tap, 300 milligrams caffeine. Gray camouflage. Dallas Cowboys. Interesting because, like, um, Troy Aiton's from my town, Henry, Oklahoma, you know. It was, like, the, probably the most famous, like, Dallas Cowboys player. So this is a good drink for me, you know. A cool can to have. nutrition facts other ingredients and stuff distributor information the rest of the can okay anyway that's pretty much the entire can anyway now I'm going to show off the um 2023 new design Alani new energy drink cans hold on a minute the 2023 new design which is brew Alani new energy drink like the colors of the can with the green and the purple and the tealish light blue color um it looks similar to last year's design but um last year's one had basically this thing the caramel green apple with the caramel on it it was like straight up in the middle but now it's like a pot you know like a witch's cauldron there's like a skeleton like spider webs and it looks like some snakes holding some diamonds or crystals those weren't on like the last year's version so yeah, cool looking can, you know, for Halloween. Which is brew. Tastes the same though. Like a green apple. And it really tastes like caramel though. Even though, you know, it shows caramel, you know, on the green apple. It's just basically green apple, you know. Yeah, that's KU. Warning, distributor information, other ingredients. QR code projects their website. Their codes now for the nutrition box. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. Cool looking can though. Like the diamonds and stuff and the moons and the snakes. Looks pretty cool. I mean, when that's the entire can. Anyway, I'm going to finish my video, so hold on that. But I mean, when the next two reviews are going to be two new lemonade drinks that I got at Dollar Tree. Stay tuned for those reviews. See you tomorrow. Come reviews to more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.